So we're talking about Steven Seagal in 1996's Executive Decisions. So while filming Executive Decisions, Steven Seagal came in with this massive ego and inflated sense of self-pride that he wanted to come in and be the alpha male on the film set. Well, this didn't really work out because on the first day, he gave him this big rousing scene about how I'm going to do this and that, and John Leguizamo laughed at him. Well, he went up to John Leguizamo and punched him, and this started off the isolation on the set. It makes me wonder if this is the reason why they killed off Steven Seagal's character within the first 10 minutes of the movie. So it makes me wonder, when we look at the before posters and the release posters, is that why they removed him from it?